Hello and good morning. Or should that be? Hey guys, because I read this week that the most popular opening line on a YouTube video is, hey guys. Because of course there are lots of younger people that make YouTube videos. Well, whatever we do, and however we introduce ourselves, today I'm fishing on the Staffordshire Worcestershire Canal. Mmm, first cup of tea of the day. That's always very welcome indeed, isn't it? But before I even thought about pouring that, I cast out. I'm watching a little orange tip sticking above the water. I've been fishing for a couple of days. Work and other stuff just comes, not necessarily in the way, because that's saying that it's a problem, but there are priorities in life. And do you know what? When I don't go fishing, I don't even think about it. I'm not desperate to get back onto the bank. And that's why I've said on so many occasions, there's a difference between a passion, which angling is for me, and an obsession, which it isn't. However, when the time comes round to get back out there, I'll tell you what, I'm certainly a happy camper. I've put some maggots out. I'll mix some ground bait in a moment or two when I finish this cup of tea. Some brown crumb. And then I'll be back with a fish. And I do catch a variety of species when I'm fishing this way. And today I'm going to go for a perch. That's the first one on the bank. Got a young mallard there going up to the flow, pecking it. See if it can, it can eat it. Tell you what, there's been there's been four young on this section. I've fished here for a number of times in recent weeks. Four young and a mother, and the young are now well well developed. Not quite as big as the mother yet, but it won't be long before they'll all be looking the the same size. It's great to see development, growth, and nature at this time of the year. Lots of young birds. I'm getting my first bite here. The mallards are still around the float. Four of them now, they've uh, all joined in. The floats dipping and bobbing though. Shall I strike? Yes, I will. It's a lively fish, not a big one. I will use the net though, because I want to make sure I can lift it out of the water safely. I think it might be a perch. Indeed it is. Don't want it to drop off, not a big fish. Don't think, oh, landing net. Must be a, a big mon a big fish here, a monster. No, it's just a case of making sure that when I lift it out of the water, it's okay. I'm actually going to need the disgorger on this one. Before I do though, there you go. I have the feeling this, oh, I missed that one. I have the feeling that this is going to be another one of those. I don't show everyone to the camera sessions. I think it's going to be busy. I'm fishing with maggot. Double maggot though on a size 14 hook. But I'm fishing at a time of the year where the fish themselves are very active. They're on the munch, aren't they? I will show this one though, when I can get a firm grip on it because it's a, a better perch. Just small ones so far. That's the biggest on the bank this morning. And I will show this one purely and simply because it's a, a second species, a roach. A third fish on the bank. It's a bream. The sun is well and truly popping its head over the horizon now. I'm drenched in warmth, which I'm not complaining about. Of course, it's a great time of the year. Not necessarily good conditions for fishing though, which is why I was up early. And if you can do that, fish late in the evening or through the night. Whatever type of fishing we do though, it's all about enjoyment. And I've certainly done that today. Uh, lots of perch, a few bream and a couple of roach on the bank. I'll be reeling in for the final time in a moment or two. 
and then back home, showered, get dressed properly, as it were, as opposed to my fishing clothes. And then on with the rest of the day. See you soon.